You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? Yeah, we made him spend a lot There's of his money. Girls. I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Your partner? Your buddy to drink with? Or just a machine? Designed to accomplish a task. You could have shot those two girls, but you didn't. Why didn't you shoot, Connor? Ooh. Don't Some push me. Some suddenly enter into your program? No. I just decided not to shoot. That's all. But are you afraid to die, Connor? I would certainly find it regrettable to be interrupted before I can finish this investigation. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Uh... Nothing? Oblivion? Android heaven? No. Nothing. There would be nothing. <gasps> Rude. Ooh. He's looking dashing. I need your help. Sneaky. I wanted to join them. But they didn't wait for me. Typical elevator riders not waiting for others. I know. So rude. <gasps> Look at that Roomba. A big Roomba. Okay, weird that they're all occupied. Except the one. How convenient. All right, you get the platform, I'll take care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. <laughs> Thank you for the reminder. Where did they even get this? I wonder if there are people, like, inside that are just like, oh, what's going on? I swear this is like some Mission Impossible crap, and he's still using those dress shoes. <laughs> Where the heck did they find all this? Looks bugged if you ask me. Hey, do you understand what I'm saying? Call Central, fast! Central, we got armed intruders, Sent. That's what I get they for not- here now. You better be fast. That's what I get for not drawing my gun. Simon, the shot! God damn it. We need to record our message. We haven't got much time. You're looking at the screen, she is. Who's that? Who's that, Mochi? That's Marcus. He's an android. <sighs> Hi, 
I know, I'm hurrying, I'm hurrying. Oh boy, oh boy, oh no, 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 no. Simon, they're coming! I... I can't, Marcus. Go without me! Simon! Alright, I failed you earlier, but we are taking you with us. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. If they find him, they'll access his memory, they'll know everything. We can't leave him behind. We have to shoot him. That's murder. We can't kill him, he's one of us. Marcus, it's your call. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, Simon. I don't have a choice. There's always a choice. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Let's go. <laughs> I mean, they're right in that they could access his memory and that's and that was like the biggest reason why bring you these images which have just been broadcast on detroit's citywide news channel a group of androids infiltrated the stratford tower and hacked into you the did the same and felt bad i feel awful looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids the operation resulted in one casualty a broadcasting station operator shot dead by the terrorists these events took place just a few feet from the studio while the program was going i shouldn't wide. have shot the Everybody guy here is still in shock. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. I should have just spared the operator, god damn it. I found two deviants at the Eden Club. I hope to learn something, but they managed to escape. That's too bad. You seem so close to stopping them. I don't care if you don't like me, Amanda. You seem a little sus. <laughs> you seem lost, Connor. I don't know. I don't know. This is going to be bad for me later. This is going to be bad for Connor later. I'm going to be in for a world of hurt. If your investigation doesn't make progress soon. You're starting to piss me off with that coin, Connor. <laughs> Sorry, Lieutenant. Set. Cast their message live. Then made their getaway from the roof. I didn't have to kill him. Whatever. If the FBI would take over the investigation, you soon be off the case. No, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. Okay. Don't fuck up my crap seat. Those were fighting words. <laughs> Agreed. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. Anything else I should know? No. Nothing. Are you gonna tell him the name? Those are some nice eyebrows. <laughs> Turn yourself in, or two innocent androids will be shut down because of you. That last guy, though. You're going to be switched off. We're going to search your memory and tear you apart piece by piece for analysis. Dang. You're going to be destroyed. Do you hear me? Destroyed! This is such a big shift from, like, the chapter previously with... I do not want to probe your memory. 
deviants have just been caught. They gave you up. There's no point in lying. We know everything. Shaking my controller. Hank. Hank. I need help. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Please, 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 please. Come on, 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 come on. I am so stressed out. I am so stressed out. Was that supposed to happen? I shook my freaking... Should I have checked the rooftop first? Fuck. You here. Otherwise, I'd... Connor. <sighs> Connor, no. I didn't check the roof. I thought I had to do that first and then check the roof. God. I'm so annoyed. Ugh, why does this always happen to me? I want to know what's in the roof. Get some sleep. And tomorrow, you'll be stronger than me. Oh, that's sweet. So are you going to tell me what a deviant's doing in the snow with a little girl? Her father was beating her. When I saw what was happening, something snapped inside of me. All of a sudden I felt like her life was more important than mine. Oh. Baby. We're still here. I will not stand for that kind of talk. I'm not going to prison because you want to help these freaks. That is enough, Adam. That's enough. Yikes. Don't mind him. Oh, it's Kara. Starting at just eight ninety nine. Oh, should probably change that actually. Can I can I change that back? I don't want to be staring at that. Then people are gonna see and be like, oh you're definitely an android. There we go. <laughs> Is anyone else in the house? No. No, just us. Do you have any androids here? No, there are no androids here. 
Okay, this is so stressful. <laughs> yes, I was I was very much panicking. I'm always panicking. What's new? <laughs> he really didn't see me just like put something away. Ooh, can you imagine if he saw I the magazine? Go. Thanks for the coffee. If I like did nice flip evening. the page, he probably would have seen the photo. Oh my god. Is somebody else in the house? It's nothing. The the washing machine. It's an old model. It makes a terrible racket. Sorry for the inconvenience. Good evening, ma'am. It was a mistake to reach out to them. They'll never negotiate with their slaves. We should have shown them that we're prepared to fight. Violence is never the answer. Dialogue is the only way. I'm sure the humans will listen to us. Yeah, I accidentally... Not accidentally, but I killed someone because of you, North. Simon gave his life for our cause. What difference does that make? He's a hero. You are free. You are free. We are superior to them, but they are our masters? That's about to change. Marcus, I don't know how I feel about all these things you're saying. I was like, he was you're super sweet, super nice, and now he's... It's up to you to decide. You know. Like I said, I blame Leo. I'm gonna send the humans a message. Mmm, the music. Jesus. Marcus. Violence is the only language humans understand. No. I want them to understand that I do not want to start a war. They won't listen if they're not afraid. Then they won't have a choice. Sorry, North. I listened to you once and I screwed up, so. You should have done the equal rights one. I don't know. I like the we have a dream. without violence just like you wanted you're reaching out to them when all they feel for us is contempt i hope you know what you're doing you can't fight violence with violence yeah north unless there's no other choice oh my god why am i stuck with her again <laughs> they killed our people marcus we want justice marcus they have to pay Please don't give me this choice. You don't have to do this. No. Please. Please. An eye for an eye, the world goes blind. We won't punish a crime with another crime. They're gonna heed me! Sorry, North. I like you, but... We interrupt this broadcast with breaking news. This just in. The beginning of a terrorist campaign. Maybe if y'all weren't right such dicks to United androids. States. It's like the Avengers headquarters. <laughs> I'm just a machine replacing another machine, Lieutenant. You shouldn't get emotional about it. Fuck you. Hey there, Mr. Krabs. I know, I've been saying, do you feel it now, Mr. Krabs, for a while? 
and I need to stop because it's not funny anymore. <laughs> She's very pretty. Oh. What the heck? Mr. Kamsky. He looks like he's a bit of a dick. Young and beautiful forever. Creep. A flower that will never wither. Why is this what giving is me like super Westworld vibes right now? It's up to you to answer that fascinating question, Connor. What the heck? Destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. Or spare it, if you feel it's alive. But you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. Okay, I think we're done here. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you What's out of here. What's more important to you, Connor? Your investigation, or the life of this android. Decide who you are. An obedient machine. Or a living being. Endowed with free will. That's enough. Connor, we're leaving. Pull the trigger. Uh, listen Connor. to Mr. Krabs. Don't. And I'll tell you what you want. I'm not gonna do it. I can't. Fascinating. Cyberlife's last chance to save humanity. Oh, look at him. Is he looks like a beat up puppy. I'm. I'm not a deviant. You prefer to spare a machine rather than accomplish your mission. You saw a living being in this android. You showed empathy. He is not help. He was not much help. Go back into your stupid pool. By the way, forget I said it was cool. I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. You never know. What does he mean? That was our chance to learn something, and you let it go. Yeah, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. I'm sorry. Okay? Thanks for trying to stick up for me, though. Do the right thing. Aww. He likes us. <laughs> Holy crap! Don't shoot them, please. They're not doing Jesus. anything. They're just marching. Holy Christ! Oh man, that escalated. Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. There's more of us. We can take them. No. If we attack, we'll start a war. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand their ground, even if it means dying. Please don't. Please, please, please. This oh my god. This is your last chance. Disperse immediately, or you will all be killed. We have to show them we won't back down. We stay right here. Disperse! This is your last chance! Please, please! Marcus, what are you doing? They're gonna kill us all!
That's so messed up. Oh. Oh. I'm kind of glad they jumped After what happened today, right into this because the they didn't give me enough time to like fully master. start crying. Humans if they do no something to Connor, to I think. Them. I thought Kemsky knew something. I think I might flip. Oh, Connor. Perkins, you fucking cocksucker. <laughs> Stop it, Lieutenant. I mean, go. Yikes. Hey, Connor. I'm talking to you, asshole. This. Where are you going? Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? I've been removed from the case. I'm going to register the evidence in my possession, and then I'm going to leave. Good. I hear from you way back. All right, great value, Ben Affleck. Calm down. I hate this dude. Freaking douchebag. Hank's password. What would a hard-boiled eccentric police lieutenant choose? <laughs> Fucking Obviously. password. It's not much, but it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his address. He'll be able to hide you until things calm down. Oh, thank you. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. What? <laughs> I'm so thrown off. This is not Connor. <laughs> He actually looks kind of cute with the beanie and everything, but that's just so not him. Alice. I... what? That's why she was talking that way when she was in the she bed. She loves you more than anything in the world. She became the little girl you wanted, and you became the mother she needed. Forgetting who you are, to become what someone needs you to be. Maybe that's what it means to be alive. Kara, is there something wrong? Why would you want to be distant? That, I mean... We'll be together forever, won't we, Kara? Yes. Forever. Ah! Whatever. It's fine. Succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. Him. It's time to decide. A 
I'm doing it. Screw it. <laughs> Screw you, Amanda. Recorder, over there. Follow me. This way. <gasps> oh no no no. I feel like I just keep making a, a stupid freaking <laughs> face with everything that's happening. Honor. Oh shit. for a while now I was wondering are we friends sure I agree there's no reason a human and a machine can't be friends right I mean I'm glad you said yes mm -hmm. 